Welcome back to my home, Cooks this Chef. We're gonna do something a little bit differently. I've been actually going around, you know, trying to shop for a new, uh, some pots and pans, and some new kitchen equipment and stuff like that. So, you know, I, I went around to different places and I didn't find any. I went around to Costco's, uh, Sam's Club, um, you know, Frost and different places like that. But I found one spot I really, really love, which is Home Goods. And so I did a really, like a little, you know, uh, uh, pots and pans, you know, utensils, haul. So I'm about to get ready to get home and show you what I found and it was real reasonable and stuff like that. And why I'm gonna recommend, you know, saying you go out and checking out home goods, you know, and also too, shopping around before you buy in your pot sets. And right now, after the holidays, a lot of them, a lot of them, this is the best time to find them on sale. But if you wanna look for some nice, chic things for your home, go to home goods, especially for your kitchen. All right, you guys, so I'll see you when I get in. You know, I'm back from Home Goods. Did a little good, uh, you know, a uh, uh, shopping haul for the kitchen. Um, I, you know, I had a good time, you know, going out there, you know, trying to check out different things and stuff like that. Next time I'll take you guys along with me as I run around the store and stuff like that. But, you know, how people react a little weird when you got a camera or a phone in your hand. So, uh, I'm going to show you what the haul that I have got. You know, so it's pretty nice stuff. Um, pretty reasonable and I was looking for a different pot. Now you can go different places now. I know I mentioned about Costco, Sam, so they do have some great sales too, but you know, it wasn't what I was looking for, you know, um, you know, and let me know in the comments if there are other places that you find your, you know, kitchen equipment. So I'm gonna let you know what the pot set is. It's a set, but kind of not, but I'll show you what I'm talking about. So what brought my attention, you know, got my attention was this item right here. You know, uh, this is the first thing that kind of drew my attention. But, you know, the reason why is because uh, I've been looking for something, you know, a lot of times you ever get that, you know, when you're going around shopping with something and you can't find it, you, you get that feeling like, man, you know, but when, you, when you see it, it's, it's it, it's it. And that's how I felt about it when I saw this. Now, this bad boy, he is humongous. You know, uh, I took a lot and, you know, saying for others and stuff like that. But I like this because of the wood, the wood grain it had on it. You know, um, how big it is. It's almost the size of a paella pan. And stuff like that i can do many things in this dish you know and i really like it because i always do a lot of you know uh we entertain a lot so you know i wanted to do it so it was a pretty good uh, buy it was a non-stick uh pot and stuff like that and this brand was the element what is it called it's called uh natural elements so i i so i went around trying to look for more of the same type of style because you know our kitchen we have a normal a natural element type countertops all over the kitchen so we wanted to stay with the theme and you know it's time to you know out with the old and in with the new so i went around there checking out different things and i found more of them and stuff like that and actually it was really real reasonable now this one is a wok i wish i did like i did like the handle that it had on it you know the nice wood grain handle was real smooth and uh, it definitely feels like you know they uh, you know put some good care into it nice top you know and they have like little pores you know on each side so you know i felt like this was a uh, good and this one didn't range that much i think it was no more than like i think um how much was it average price 50 bucks um this was no average price 60 dollars that's what it says no no yeah 60 dollars but uh it was half price which was uh, 29 bucks so I felt that was a good buy so I was trying to get a lot of stuff to actually use so this really was gonna come in handy you know so I put this to the side and I'll show you the other stuff so I, I mean I got, got a lot of different um, shapes and sizes for different things that I cook with and stuff because you know you know you want to get a good set the first time you know you don't want to buy tons of stuff now I do collect a lot of pots and pans and skillets and this and that so um, but but um, I wanted to get one to kind of those with the theme of the kitchen. Now this one was a nice, you know what I'm saying, stew or soup and stuff like that, uh, a pot as well. And I really did like this one. You know, uh, this is a saucepan, you know, come with a nice top on it and everything like that. You know, um, you know, you know, not, you know, like I say, it comes with a pour, you know, I'm just, you know, so I, you know, I could drain it if I'm doing pasta or something like that, or do some kind of noodles of uh, in that nature. But I'll show you, let me see if I can move this right here. Um, And I was looking for like a gumbo pot, <laughs> you know. Uh, and then I found this one. You know, uh, gumbo, they normally a big gumbo pot and stuff like that. I didn't want one too big. This was just right, you know, uh, uh, for me to get. Uh, 
should tip this all out before I press play, but it's okay. So I got this one. Now, and I love this. Stew pot, you know what I'm saying? Something that, you know, and all of these are nonstick. I just want to let you know. I love it. I love the, like I said, my favorite thing is the wood grain on the handles and here and there. You know, and obviously with wood, it's not going to get hot. So that's one thing I did like about that. So I, I had got this one. And this one is, you know, uh, uh, a deep, you know what I'm saying, uh, stock pot. So I want to put this on. Uh, so lose, lose a lot of space. You know, and you know, a lot of times when you search around, when you're trying to find your different pot sets and different things and stuff like that, a lot of those sets, uh, you know, they're not durable, you know, and that's what I'm looking for, more of a durable set, you know, uh, something that's not, you know, rinky dink or, you know, flimsy and stuff like that. So I was like, well, since I got that, then I might as well get the rest of the sets to go with it, which was, you know, the uh, frying pan and, and, um, uh, a little small pot so i didn't they didn't have the same brand which it was okay but one thing i like about home goods is they have several different you know brands but they can be similar so i got these two you know so i did like this you know it's what this was for master your master class this is a really nice one nice wood grain handle which i wanted to stick, stick with the theme of the pots that i had and i had this one too as well you know, so this is a nice skillet and this one you know you can make eggs or something small yeah, so I wanted to get two different ones. So this one was 12 bucks for this. Really heavy duty, nice, non-stick. And this one was 19. So that's a good price, you know, for both of them. But, you know, and last but not least, with the pot set, I wanted to get a, a little small one, you know, like I said, a little small one to go with the, the rest of the set. You know, you can piece your sets together. A lot of people like to do it with the same name, but it doesn't matter, you know, to me, you know, as long as it cooks well and it does the job. You know, I like the way it is, you know, nice. And this is really, really nice. This is a master class too. You know, nice wood grain, you know, top to bottom handles are really nice, you know, saying uh, style and everything like that. And this is no more than 14 bucks. You know, I really did like this one the most when I saw it because I wouldn't put it down. I was like, ah, you know, what should I do? You know, it doesn't match. But, you know, uh, ask some, you know, ask some advice which was, uh, from some people that were there. And, you know, they probably, they helped me out real well. So this is a pretty good one. So I'm going to show you also too. This is, this is the last set of the pot sets that I had got. You know, and then I'll show you what else I had uh, got because some things I did need to upgrade and, uh, and I did that as well. So... When you, you know, you, when you're doing a lot of draining stuff or whatever like that, you know, um, you know, I was looking for something that drain my noodles or, or rinse off my, you know, vegetables and stuff like that. So I finally got one. You guys love this. This was no more than 10 bucks. You know what I'm saying? I think it's, it's a KitchenAid and uh, really nice and stuff like that. It sits in your sink. You know, you can pour, you know, uh, uh, silicone handles and stuff like that. Works out well. So I definitely wanted to get that. And, you know, I wanted to get some baking pans. Now, I do have some baking pans, but I wanted to get, you know, uh, different types of baking pans. This is a 9-inch uh, baking pan, and this is a 9-inch by 13. So, you know, these are pretty cool. You know, I really wanted to get them. They're really nice, you know, because uh, I'm thinking about doing a, a pecan bar. So, you know what I'm saying? I wanted to, you know, I saw one. I was like, why I get one without the other? And this one was no more than six bucks for this. And that's why I love Home Goods, because you can find some great deals. And this one was eight bucks. You know, so I wanted to get the set. So this is, you know, a pretty good uh, uh, deal as, you know, I think, you know, but uh, you let me know what you think. If you, you know what I'm saying? If you have any other places, I'll definitely go around, you know, finding, you know, uh, uh, other spots. I like to, I like to shop for stuff in the kitchen, you know what I'm saying? So you can ask anybody, <laughs> you know. So this one I felt needed to come in handy was something to the house my salt. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Because I don't use a lot of heavy salts. But I wanted to have it, you know what I'm saying, when I'm, you know, uh, cooking. And also, too, this is for my olive oil. I got some garlic-infused olive oil that I wanted to actually, you know, to put in here. You know what I'm saying? So it makes it much more easier when I'm, you know, cooking things and, you know, showing you different things like that. So this is a really, was a really good buy, too. This was only four bucks. And this was six bucks. Well, yeah, six bucks. So they have a lot of good prices there at Home Goods. A lot of good items to go, you know what I'm saying, get. You know, they're not sponsoring this. This is all stuff that I bought. You know, saying like that, you know, everything that I wanted to buy, that I, you know, certain little items, you know, you need and stuff like that. So they were great with that. Some stuff I wanted, I was looking for a uh, uh, um, uh, salt, pepper uh, shaker, which was, you know, a grinder. 
you know, uh, pepper uh, corn uh, grinder. They did have a couple of them, but I didn't like them. I was looking for like a big wooden one, you know, uh, to have or electric one, you know, uh, either one. I do see a lot of them on the market, you know, but, you know, that's, you know, a lot of, you know, uh, this is what all the little haul I did get. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know this is something, you know, so unusual for me to do, but I wanted to show you a little, you know what I'm saying, haul that I got from Home Goods. Hope you enjoyed it. You know, so come on back. I'll be look out for my Black History Month where I'll be having some soul food, you know, some dishes that I'll be having throughout the month of February. So stay tuned. I'm your chef KC. Thanks for stopping by the Urban Culture Kitchen, you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next one. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. If you're not new, thanks for tuning in.